Hello, I'm Andrew Lissim, and welcome back to Democracy 3 Africa. Hopefully, we're not going to get assassinated this time, but the chance is fairly high. Let's be completely honest. So, we're going to play as Ghana today. We're actually slowly getting more and more easy as we go up. Um, Ghana is the 10th largest uh, diamond exporter in the world, um, second largest producer of gold in Africa, uh, projected to be the largest cocoa producer in the world in 2015, lots of oil. So basically it's got a lot of local resources, like natural resources, just in the country, and we can try and exploit that. However, it's got massive public like resource mismanagement, um, public debt is incredibly high, so I'm expecting to have to do some physical reforms as soon as we get in, really. Uh, inconsistent supply of electricity, sparrow to economic growth, and crumb corruption are a little bit iffy. And what is the, uh, FGM? Female gentleman? Do we just not have any? What? It's Christian, by the way, it's 71%, but I can't see any female gentleman mutilation, which is... Huh, maybe this is a country that's actually sensible. Um, you will be... The free no, do we do the number four? Who are we gonna be? You shall be the militant movement, and we will be Oh Peace and Development, People's Action. But then we're just PAP. And I don't want to be PAP, because then you sound like gynecological um test. I don't want to be a PAP snare. Uh People's Movement, maybe. People's Revolutionary Democratic Front. I'm going to do that one, and the reason is, it's ridiculous. The People's Revolutionary Democratic Front. It's like, oh, we are the People's Republic of China. By the way, censorship. And it's like, oh, we are the, uh, what was North Korea? Uh, the Democratic Republic of North Korea. It's DM us. Yeah, so Democratic Republic of North Korea. It's like, you're not democratic in any way. So let's do that. We might end up being militants. Who knows? Okay, crime is mm, fine. Poverty's not bad. Unemployment's not bad. Um, yeah. Okay, so what are issues? Asthma, poor infrastructure, brownouts, homelessness, malaria. FGM, which exists, but at the minimum value. That's annoying. It's just above the start trigger. Um, we have skill shortage, we have low GDP, technology backwater, pollution, uncompetitive economy. I don't have much political power. Huh. Our debt is eight years worth of income. Okay. Right. What's the state of our... We've got quite a lot of socialists. Conservatives are actually less than the socialists. We could pander to the socialists and possibly win via a socialist uprising. Um, rural and motorists, there's quite a lot of. Elderly are pretty small. In, on all honesty, like you can crank up some of the like inheritance taxes and stuff that elderly hate. And No, you get rid of pensions. That's it. You get rid of pensions, right? And because pensions only affect the elderly. Like, where, where is it? Elderly. Pension, 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 pension. We don't have uh, pensions for the elderly. We've got private pensions. We don't have, like, actual national... Ah, that's saving us money. Okay. Uh, right. We need to get more money, and we need to fix stuff. Possibly not in that order. Okay. How long is my term? Where is my term limit? Term length, four years. Okay, I want to up that, but I can't because it costs 40. Um, where is my term limit? Two. I want to raise that eventually. Oh, 50 to raise it. Wow. Um, press freedom. Bye bye, press freedom. People will like us. Oh, drilling opportunity. Allow it. We need the money. Polls. We've got 4% of the vote already. Just by banning the press. It's pretty good. Okay, we're up to 33. 
Um, how do we want to do this? I would like to raise our flat tax. We could just go to 90%. Wealthy will hate us. Like, let's revert that. How many people are classified as wealthy here? A few. A few. They will just hate us, like, so much. They'll probably kill us anyway. Uh, let's go to... 70%, right? So that gives us 16, where we had 6 before. That gives us 10. So it's, like, almost doubling our income, right? We're in 71. Wait, yeah, 70. Apply. Next turn. We've got so little political capital right now. Public smoking ban. Uh, ban it. I need the health. 3% the vote. And we've got a lot of money spare. Okay. I need to get more political capital because right now we just don't know enough to implement like a lot of the things I want to implement. Trying to think of how the best way to do this is. I mean, we can open up. Ah, see, that's already fairly high, right, for demonstration. I was trying to think of ways to like increase democracy because I kind of crushed it by getting rid of the press. Doesn't increase it very much. Liberals, conservatives, and religious. How many of the conservatives are religious? Conservatives are half the population. Religious are less than half the population. This is already fairly high as well. I can't really do much to... I could, I could introduce new measures, right? To increase the uh, democracy. For now, let's just start tackling some of the infrastructure things. Let's crank up that, which will increase infrastructure. Um, what's this? Traffic congestion. Okay. Well, traffic, transport. Let's get ourselves telecommuting initiative. And that'll improve infrastructure, mainly because uh, there's more like investment in telecoms and stuff. Our membership goes down, which is fine. We also want I'm trying to think of some way to improve the infrastructure. What was it? Um Economy Micro Grants. Do we already have micro grants in place? Well, that's public services, tax. Where would it be? Law and order, transport. What are you? Agricultural efficiency. Oh, okay. I can't see it. Maybe I'm just blind. Oh, it's an attack. Ah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. And let's crank that up. Power blackouts go down. CO2 emissions go down. Environmentalists like it. Uh, the environment gets better. Environment uh, efficiency goes up. And we get energy efficiency. Like, it's just a really good policy. And it's fairly costly. Like, a fairly cheap cost as well. Um, what else do we want? We go for open plant government offices and decrease uh, a lot of the uh, corruption going on. Community policing, racial discrimination, intellectual property, gender discrimination act. Yeah, let's get gender discrimination act because we do got to remember that like women will kill us. Conservatives dislike it, but we've got to remember that women will kill us. Freedom fighter wins case. Awesome. Seven percent of the vote. Okay, I'm doing pretty well. Right. Gotta make a play for the socialists at some point.
I have the gains tax I would ideally want to get rid of at some point, but it's going to cost me stuff, and I don't want to use it right now. Um, what else do we need? Genital mutilation ban. Yep, straight up doing it. What else? We get um, agriculture dealer network. It's fairly expensive, actually. Yes, foreign language curriculum. Pages dislike it, but Pages are going to have to suck it up. There's not many of them. It's probably enough to kill me, let's be honest. The history with Patriots hasn't been particularly great. Um, what else? Bus lanes. Motors will hate it. Biofuel subsidy. Now, the problem with biofuel in real life, right? Biofuel is effectively where you use crop-derived oils to be able to drive cars. Um... The problem with biofuel in real life is like biofuel in the UK. It's like excellent, yeah. You know, this is not burning oil that's mined from the ground, so it's just, you know, carbon that goes into the crops, it's then burned and then goes into the atmosphere and then goes into the crops. But where does that oil come from? It's grown overseas. Um normally in places like Africa and Asia. And what do we do? We pull it over here in giant tankers that use oil to get it over here. Like it's not as efficient as people want you to claim, because people forget about the transport cost of it. Um, which is a real issue with it in real life, because it's actually, in theory, kind of good. Um, farmers like it, because farmers grow it. Um, and environmentalists like it. Let's check farmers, environmentalists, rural. Um, environmentalists. I mean, there's enough environmentalists to make it worth our while. Ah, but Freedom of Information Act. Improves democracy, gets rid of corruption. Yeah. And there's actually enough liberals in the country that's worth pandering to liberals here. Children's food. Uh, yeah, let's regulate children's food. 15% of the vote already. And our debt's down to three quarters of what it was. I'm an amazing Prime Minister, President. I don't know what I am. Um... We need more capital because I need to be able to crank up my term length. I think I might be able to win the vote without cranking up the... Uh, right, because you can crank up the term length and you can crank up the number of terms that you could have. I don't think we need to crank up the term length. Because right now we're up 50% already and there's time to go. How are you doing down here? Almost ended. Almost ended. And we're helping the asthma epidemic, but that's going to take a little while to fix. Um, if we provide uh, housing, socialists will love us, and it will get rid of the homelessness epidemic. The thing is, do I have to reshuffle my cabinet? Actually, my cabinet should be getting me a lot of power. I'm going to hold off for the moment. I will need 50 to be able to uh, make the term length, like, unending. Uh, sorry, the number of terms. Because it costs us 50 to get that to here. So for now, uh, I would like housing. State housing. There we go. Uh, it will cause poverty to go down. Poor earnings go up. Socialism increases. Socials like it. Equality is good. Poor like it. Homelessness goes massively down. I mean, it does cost a lot to put it up to there. I think it's probably enough to put it to about here. That's one of the few times I won't, like, max it out. But that's because I kind of want to have a lot of uh, extra income coming in. Uh, a lot to deal with our debt. Right, petrol tax is fine. Revenue administration. No, it's fine. Property tax. Mm. 
What happens if I do that? Wealthy, elderly, middle income. Equality, socialists like it. But it doesn't actually raise that much money. We're talking maybe 2 billion. Which is reasonable, but it's not enough to make me want to just crank it out. That's fine. Capital gains tax. If I crank it up too high, it'll get rid of GDP. And honestly, it gets rid of GDP as it is. I'd probably just nuke it. Micro generation. Oh, yeah. I want that. Corporate tax. I might have to lower this a little bit. Just to get more like people into the country. Alcohol tax. Meh. Yeah. Okay. So... You're really not going to like this, religious people. But let's get rid of the technology backwater. Oh, I can't, because it costs too much. Okay. In which case... Oh, you've already got, like, modern textbooks and stuff. What about, like, science funding? Ah, you've got no science funding. You've got, like, test tubes. Particle accelerators. It costs, like, 1.5 billion for particle accelerator, apparently. Which is completely inaccurate. Okay. Got 13 left. What can we do with 13? Um, food stamps, rent control, economy. Yeah, the cost for this, like 8 million, it's completely worth it to do that. The efficiency goes up, the rural income goes up, um, rural people like it, self-employed people like it, and it's very cheap. Hybrid car initiative. It's fairly cheap, it only takes one quarter. It's very tempting, actually. Intellectual property rights. Yep, I'm sorry. Capitals like it, foreign, like, investment, foreign relations, technology. It's just too useful. Credit rating upgraded. We're now AAA! Bizarre. 80% uh, of the vote. Rural terrorists, maybe. Let's look at this. Yeah. Rural terrorists and the Matrix of Justice and our security is useless. So, we're going to have to... Oh my god, look. We don't have very much this turn, do we? We're going to have to raise our security rating. So, let's look at security. No, honestly, most of it's already there, and we can't, like, implement these because they cost too much. So, I'm going to say the police force probably needs to go max. Armed police. I'll keep it where it is for the moment. Intelligence services. Satellites. I don't want to be murdered. That's my entire policy, is based around, I do not want to be murdered. I tend to find it's a good policy, personally. Extensive rehabilitation. Sure. Let's do it. And can I afford to raise you? No. Cost 10. Okay. Feminist plot. There we go. The feminist plot's beginning. Uh, 70%. Airplane crash. Okay. We're just going to have to keep up in the security rating as much as possible. Uh, we could get wiretapping. People don't like it. But it's too good. Let's just have it down here for the now. Don't want to piss people off too much. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, oh, oh my... Oh, my sweet summer child. I thought I was doing well. People were liking me. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear. You've been the victim of a carefully planned assassination of a group of extremists in the Matrix of Justice opposed to your government's political agenda. A patriarchal agenda. 
You secretly stoned death in the bomb in one of your press conferences. You and a number of your administrators have been killed. You turned a blind eye to the concerns of the across your nation and paid the ultimate price. I banned for you much mutilation. Uh, uh, mutilation. I, um, uh, I put in like a discrimination act and stuff. People were actually liking me already. I mean, I know that my security was useless and I was only slowly improving it, but it's because I got, I was like, you know, people like me and this place already has a really low rate of female genital mutilation. <sighs> apparently, literally the only way to keep women in line in a country, in any country, is apparently through mass surveillance, armed police, uh, security services, maximum police force. You wiretap everyone's phone. Um, it doesn't matter what country. Any country, the women, they apparently, they're all out to get you. I mean, uh, women who watch my videos, um, or who define yourself as women. Please let me know down below how you are planning to kill me so that uh, my intelligence people can uh, monitor and figure out a counter plan for the repeated assassinations I've suffered. So, if you're planning to murder me, let me know down below. And uh, if you've liked, like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. Until next time. Stay shiny.